What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Tatiana Alexandria and I'm back with another vlogging vlog. Today is Wednesday. Happy Wednesday. Y'all know I'm having a date on the bottom of the screen because your girl mine is bad and I don't remember what today is. I know, sad. But if you're new here, welcome to my channel. Make sure you subscribe, like and comment, and watch the video all the way through, okay? And if you've been rocking with your girl from way back when, hey girl, welcome back. Or hey bro, welcome back. So, yeah, it's the start of another weekly vlog. So, yeah. I need to wash my hair, don't mind that. But I just got done doing my sleek bun tutorial on natural hair YouTube video. I'll link it below so you guys can go check it out after this video. But yeah, I just got done doing that. It's like 3.22 p.m. later on in the evening. But, yeah. I woke up way earlier, probably like 8 or 9 in the morning. But I had just got done with the video. I had edited, did the thumbnail, did the voiceover for it, and uploaded that probably like at 3 o'clock. So that is up. Go run the views up. But now I'm about to show you guys some stuff that I just came in the mail from Amazon that I ordered sometime last week. And the first thing is BH Essentials Tea Tree Oil and Prebiotic Daily Feminine Wash. And it's like a pH balance. Basically, like a feminine wash. So I tried out their prebiotic and probiotic with cranberry vitamins i think it's like a it was like a month's worth um they were okay but i don't think i'll be trying them again but i heard a lot of good stuff about their wash on tiktok lately so i had to get it so hopefully i like this i'm gonna use it for a few weeks and see how it goes and i will update y'all because i've been looking for a good feminine wash for a while now so hopefully i like this one um I have used Honey Pots before. I think it's the light blue bottle, the sensitive wash, but mm, I don't really like them much either. So hopefully this does the job and I really, really like it. If not, I will just keep trying out different ones to see which ones I like. And if you use Feminine Wash and you're watching this and you have a really good one that you like, come below and let me know so I can know which one to get. Cause I don't know, but I got this and then I had got this OGX coconut coffee scrub and wash so i'm just gonna use this as a body scrub and I'm, so that means i'm only gonna use it like once or twice a week because i already have um my other favorite body washes that i'll be using and i'll just use this mainly for a body scrub because i ran out of my last body scrub and i heard good things about this as well but this has been out for a while but i want to try it out because i've always wanted like a coffee kind of body scrub so that's why i got it and then I got these lip glosses. It was a pack of five, but I gave my sister the coconut kind. I've used these lip glosses before a few times and I love them every time I use them, but they're by Broadway. And I just got these cause they were cheap and it was in a pack. But I got the rose hip oil one. I got the mint oil one. Then I had got the mango one. This is the one I'm super excited to try. It's the mango butter one. And then I got the argan oil one. And then it came with a coconut oil one, but I gave it one to my sister. And I tried the coconut oil before, I loved it, but I haven't tried any of these before. Well, no, I tried the rose hip oil before, I liked it, but I haven't tried the other ones, so. I real filmed some lip gloss, because you know, you're obsessed with lip gloss. And I just was about to run out of lip gloss, so I was like, let me order some lip gloss. So I got that. So next is gonna be where it's from Amazon too, it's just a regular non-dated weekly planner. And I got undated because the year's been over, but I want to start getting my stuff more organized and together. So I was like, let me get a planner. And I just like undated planners better anyways. So you don't have to like hurry and throw it away when the year's over or whatever. So this is how it looks on the inside. It has like a habit tracker at the bottom. It has the weekly glow, weekly goals on the side right here to-do list and then you put the week of your weekly focus and then these are the days of the weeks on this side and you just write like you know the stuff that you gotta do on it so this is how this side look with the days of the week and then this is the to-do list the habit tracker all that stuff so i'm super excited to do this because i needed new planners everything so like i said i'm trying to get more organized and shit together etc so what better way to help do it with planners and stuff so i got this one from amazon it's just like a cute little pink color with like the little gold things on the side they had other colors too but i wanted this one 
and then i showed y'all in my last vlog i believe this content planner like for social media because i know i do social media i'm a content creator so it's always good to have like a content planner or a calendar or something just to keep it more organized with like your collabs when you gotta post where you gotta post it when you gotta post it by stuff like that so i was in my last vlog that elise face had posted this on her story it's from girl co and i'll link it below i'll link everything i'm showing y'all today below so y'all go get it but yeah it's a concept planner i haven't started using it yet i probably had it for like two weeks or so now but i am gonna start using it this week for real i was waiting on the rest of my planners and stuff to come so i could start fresh and new in all my planners but yeah this is how it look and i showed y'all the last vlog how i look but i'll show y'all again a few pages go get the book so y'all can see everything for yourselves but if you want it brain dump they have like a monthly feature brands like brands you want to work with items to feature in the photos feed aesthetic that you love the shoot days like where you take your pictures and videos what else stuff like this shoot locations products to shoot content ideas did you complete everything how to improve next week today's mood things i enjoyed goals i met this week's content plans like it's a lot and i love it because like i said i do a lot of social media stuff and it's good to have like a planner just to keep everything together they have a section where you put your notes your manifestations your posting schedule what else um it has like affirmations and stuff in here it also has like habit tracker in here as well what else questions to ask happiness log check-ins it has a lot of stuff in there so i'm super excited to start writing in this yeah self-care log reminders it got everything that you could think of in this book so i definitely recommend y'all to go get it i'm gonna look at it some more today but yeah super cute and super affordable so i mean next two books i got and the last things i'm showing y'all right now are from this brand called what was it called likely maybe studios and i think these are on sale right now because she's gonna stop selling journals and stuff so i need to go ahead and hear up and get it so hopefully by the time i see this which will be like in the next six or seven days or so they'll still be on sale and they'll still be up on her website because i don't know when she take them down but i got the let's meet up one and it says it's always a good time to talk so, if y'all watch Kyla Shay, I'm gonna tell you her name. Kyla Shay on YouTube, she is the owner of Black and Make Studios, CEO, you know. And I've been watching her on YouTube, I love her, she's super pretty. All her videos are amazing, her content, I love it. So, I seen that she has some journals, so I was like, let me go ahead and get them before she take them down. So, like I said, it's called The Let's Meet Up. And this is basically like when you do meetings and stuff like that, just to stay more organized, you put notes, key points the daytime location the meeting agenda and stuff like that and this is how the page looks and basically every page looks exactly like this but i decided to get it because i know i have a business socials by tati if you don't know that you know i'm a social media coach and stuff like that but in my booking link and websites for all of that is linked below social media accounts all that stuff so go check it out after this video it's always in my description box of every single video so if you're ever interested in booking like a one-on-one -on -one phone consultation call or like a social media audit, buying a brand email list for me, um, what else? I do brand outreach now. That's where I email brands for you and get you like collabs and stuff like that, pay, give you PR. Just a whole bunch of stuff. So go check that out this video if you want to. Look with your girl and let me coach you. But anyways, that's why I got this one because when I have like phone consultation calls, etc., and if I start doing like local, like meetings and stuff with people or whatever then this book will come in handy because i need it. so i got that just to more organized my business and then the last plan i got from her is called safe place manifest your life so it's basically like a manifestation journal the freaking cover is so cute that's mainly why i got it because it's so cute and then also because i've had like i think two previous manifestation journals before and i need a new one so this is why I got this one. It's super cute. And then this is what got me. So it's super cute. This is the first page. It's so cute. Like, and this is college shade. But I didn't know. Super freaking pretty. But yeah. 
that and then basically the whole journal looks the same and it basically just says what do i see for myself in the date so yeah i didn't want that much in my journal anyways because i be writing a lot sometimes and all my other manifestation stuff but so i really just needed basically big blank pages and she delivered so that's why i got that super excited to try this out we'll start writing in it on all of them so yeah so basically, like I said, I'm going to be using this for like consultation calls and stuff like that. My session journals, stuff like that. And then this is for all my content. And then this one is just for like everyday use, like what stuff I got to do. So, and I want to get one more. Y'all probably be like, girl, you got enough planners and journals and stuff. But y'all, y'all just don't understand. I'm trying to get more organized and stuff like that. So I just need like one more type of journal and I might get it from like the Maybe Studios. I'm gonna put a picture up on the screen how I look, maybe if I remember, but it's super cute. Um, it's basically where you write like all your business ideas and stuff in it and stuff like that. So I think I wanna get there just to write like all my business ideas and stuff in it to go with this one. I'm not doing enough for the rest of the day. All I had to do was do that hair YouTube video. I edited, it, posted, did the voiceover. So that's done. And then now for one of my clients, I have to look for, but not really look for, I kind of already got a whole bunch of brands, but look for more brands to add on to this list because she had booked the brand outreach package D. It's different packages, but she got package B. Um, so I'm just putting some brands together that match her niches and so I can just be ready and more organized for later this week when I start working on her emails for her. So I had to do that today and send those up to her so she can see like which brand she want me to keep on there, which one she want me to take off, stuff like that. Revanche had some of some stuff. Revanche, I think it's called Revanche. I don't know, but it was the alcohol brand that I mentioned, I think, in my last vlog. Yeah, so they had some of some stuff after I had finished the vlog. So, so first they had some of the bottles of liquor and then they sent me like this cute drawstring backpack. They got their name on the Revanche Kanye. Hopefully I'm saying the name right. I'll link their website below. Um, but they have sent me this cute. I don't know what kind of glass this is. Like it's not a wine glass. I don't think it's probably like a martini glass. I don't know. Don't listen to me. But they sent me this cute glass with their name on it. And then they also sent me this like a drink like you know when you make a drink maybe shaking it up and stuff this is what that is it has their logo on it so cute and then it has like me this like i think this is like a tag that you put on like your suitcases and stuff like when you travel so it has their symbol on it and yeah so they sent me that then they also has sent me a um let me go get that back So they also had shumps. I can't talk. So they also had something this wine. I mean not girl. They also had some shot glass. I already been using it. But they showed me the shot glass with their symbol on it. Logo on me. And they also sent me this. I think this is a coaster. So like for your drinks and stuff with their symbol and name on it. Super cute. So yeah. So cute. That's also another thing I had to do today. I had made content for them. Well, like I had showed, you know, the products that they sent me and thanked them and stuff like that and put it on my story and made a TikTok for it. But I forgot one thing and it was show, to show the um, shot glass. So yeah, I'm on the PR list. I don't really have to post their stuff, but I did just because, because it's a nice thing to do. Why not? Because they sent me stuff. Also, I'm gonna show y'all something else later in the week that I have coming. Y'all already seen it before on one of my other vlogs, but I got some more of it. It's another PR thing, but I'm sure y'all later in the week. And I might go do some stuff this weekend or try some new foods and stuff. Y'all know the drill, so if I do, I will come back on camera and show y'all when I'm doing something. So, bye for real this time. Yeah.
is Friday and I just got a pack in the mail from Central Organic. So I'm gonna show y'all what I got. This box seems really pretty hefty than the last one I had got last month. So I want to show you guys some of the stuff I got in it because I think it's a little bit of different stuff in here than it was last time. So stay tuned. And as y'all can see, in the last clip, I had a little hard time bringing it in the house because it's like it's heavy, okay? When I say it's heavy, it's heavy. But if you open it up, don't get a knife, open it. And share what I got. Well, no, I probably can just take the tape off or use my. I don't have to see it. So I got to press on there. Y'all already know poshed. I'll link it below. Two more things popped off. Cause I was trying to use my nail because they kind of pointy to open it through the tape because I'm lazy and I don't feel like going to get the knife. But now I'm going to go get it because my nail's popping off. And if the lighting looks sucky, I'm sorry. I just want to come on here real quick to show you some of the juices I got from Suja. I'll link that right below. So y'all grabbed the first thing I saw and it was a fork. Don't judge me. So that's what I'm going to use to open this. Because it still gets the job done regardless. And also, I don't know what I'm doing later today either. Hopefully, y'all can see me because it's dark in here. But I don't know what I'm doing later today. I haven't been doing nothing. It's like noon right now. So, it's basically kind of the same stuff. I did find out that you can like tell them a few other ones that you want to try. Because they have a lot of different juices and shots, etc. Detoxes, all kinds of stuff. But yeah, you could tell them and they'll add it to your variety box. So they usually just send out variety boxes. And I also learned recently that they only send out four variety boxes out to their influencers on their PR list, because I'm on a PR list, like four times a year. So yeah, so one of them is the cold press sparkling juice. It's strawberry passion fruit. That sounds really good. And then another one that I haven't tried before is their vibrant probiotic cold juice. That looks good. I don't think they're right now. And then they just sell like, you know, what they sell before, the turmeric shots. Those are really good. They sell an energy one. Um, They sell a gut health. I did tell them to, I remember I did mention, I think gut health and the uh, vibrant probiotic. So they did listen, <laughs> but they did send those. And then it was some more X for them. I gotta go back and look at the messages. I don't think I had mentioned any green juices, which I should have because they have this one green juice. It's so good. I forgot what it's called, but it's not. And they have like three green juices. I like one of them I don't like. It's too green. Like I'll drink it because I'll just chug it because I know it's good for me. So if I know it's good for me, but it don't taste that good, I'll still chug it and drink it. I don't really care about it. But it's like two of that green juices would be so good. So basically, it looks like they just sent sparkling juices good health drinks and probiotic drinks and then the energy and turmeric and immunity and digestion i can't talk digestion shots this is a lot of shots but yeah that's pretty much it um yeah so yeah i just want to show you guys what they sent me i'm glad it came in time because i'm leaving for the weekend this weekend i don't know what i'm gonna get into but y'all will see on the vlog i'll be back maybe later today or tomorrow I need like a car mount. I got a car mount, but I couldn't find it so in time and I was kind of rushing. But I made a swing stop. I look a mess. But um yeah. They were sold out. I didn't even know they were sold out of the y'all know the wing stop like sandwich right now, the little borrow sandwich that come in different flavors like mango habanero, lemon pepper, etc. What the Y'all had to do a different angle because everybody in their car is next to me. And y'all know I'm already kind of like iffy. It's, well, not kind of. I am very scary to take pictures. I'm mean, going to take pictures to um, that too, but to record in public. So, I had to stop the video because I had got a call that I had to take. But, um, yeah. They are right now getting the to go order. So, like I was saying, they the um sandwich is sold out 
I think Nationwide or something. Whatever it's called, but it sold out. So, I ended up just getting some eight bone-in wings uh, with some voodoo fries. And voodoo fries, if you don't know about wing stuff, I think it's like cheese, ranch, and something else. But, um, and this is going to be my first time ever getting voodoo fries because, y'all, I do not eat wing stuff at all. Um, I just wanted to come here because I wanted to try the sandwich out because everybody said it was good. But, like I said, I never tried... No, the last time I tried Wingstop was like years ago. I think I've only had Wingstop maybe like two times in my whole life. Two times. But, yeah, that's why I originally came here for. Like I said, it was a sandwich, but they didn't have it. It was so out. So, we just ended up getting the wings. I got eight bone wings. I got half Hawaiian and half mango habanero. And, like I said, I got the voodoo fries and a drink. And then, yeah. So, I'm going to tear these wings up. Hopefully, they good because, y'all, if my mind and taste buds is telling me right, the last time I did try Wingstop years ago, it wasn't that good. Like, Wingstop is not really that good, so. I don't know. We shall see. But when my food get in, I'm going to show y'all my food. I'm pretty sure everybody know what Wingstop wings look like. But, yeah, so I'm waiting on that. And... Oh yeah, then after that we're gonna go into Brookshire's, which is a grocery store if you don't know, because I know some people watch me don't live in my state and I don't think every state got Brookshire's. I don't know. But we're about to go to the store after this in Brookshire's and get some teleport wine. Y'all, that wine tastes like liquor. Okay, it tastes like hard, strong liquor. It's it is wine, but it tastes really, really good. And it's called Teleport. So if you haven't tried it, definitely go try it if they sell it where you live. But y'all, it tastes real good to me. But y'all know every wine for the most part kind of tastes different. Everybody got different taste buds. So if you do end up trying to let me know in the comments how y'all like that or message me on my socials, link below. And let me know how y'all like teleport. But I tried teleport a few times and y'all it's so good. I like it mainly because see me when I drink like wine and liquor, I don't care too much about the taste. Because I'm a sugar regardless. Cause I be one I'm the type of person that want drink stuff like alcohol and wine and stuff to get tipsy fast or drunk fast. Really just tipsy fast. So because nowadays I don't really be going for like the blackout drunk. Mm, it's it's too much on me. But for the most part, I be trying to drink to get tipsy really fast. Um and for it to last a while. So yeah. Teleport definitely does the job. And Big. Now we're in the store looking for a Taylor Port, the one I was telling y'all about. Well, y'all, we can't find it, so we might go to Brookshire's because right now we're in Super One because it was closer to Wingstop, so we decided to go to Super One. So we might go in Brookshire's or either the liquor store. guys we got the goods ah, i'm gonna get drunk ah, no <laughs> okay y'all so i made it back home this is my food for wingstop these are the voodoo fries so it's jalapenos ranch cajun seasoning and cheese i believe it looks so good and then i don't know which one is this but i got hawaiian bone wings and um what was the other one mango habanero so yeah, these look kind of weird, but hopefully they taste good. So, y'all, yeah, I'm going to hit y'all back up probably tomorrow. I got my wine and my cup. Hey, guys. Happy Saturday. So, right now, we're at Starbucks getting some drinks. I'm going to share my drink when we get it. We need to drive the line right now. My ham is Swiss croissant. But the drink I had got was the iced apple crisp oat milk macchiato yeah and then i had got extra caramel Ooh, so good mm -mm. i said so good i tried it <laughs> probably then that was good and then this is the dry fruit refresher well y'all already know how they look because like i said it's a basic drink <laughs> i'll come back on camera when we get to our destination to see what we want to do so
Thing that you can like see your crystals on or something. But it's cute. Oh, I really like this mug. You say Black Girl Magic. It's so cute. Oh, look at the vintage Barbies. Oh my god. It's so cute. I have this. Oh, I would do it. I don't know why they use Barbies on. So I would do they are. It's so cute. <laughs> I'm gonna be my own best friend.